Hey guys, how you going? This is Billy 8 World and today we're going to take a look at some Dragon Warrior. I've been playing this deck a fair bit lately because Control Warrior is one of my favourite decks of all time, but it's been struggling lately against all of the aggro. The main difference between Standard Control Warrior and Dragon Warrior is pretty much just a bigger focus on minions rather than just removal. Cards like Alexstrasza's Champion, Blackwing Tech and Corruptor are all great at trading 2 for 1 and this makes a big difference against faster decks. Now, normally I'd run you guys through a more in-depth review first, but I've kind of started to realise that Hearthstone is just a really great game to watch on its own. Also, you guys are always bugging me for more live gameplay, so I figured I'd just upload some games on their own and see what you guys think. If you do like this style of video better, well make sure you let me know because this is definitely something I'm keen to work into a regular schedule. And even if you don't, as always, well don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Enjoy the games and until next time, see you later and have a good one. Okay, so it's Rogue. Therefore, it's probably aggro rogue. Therefore, we're probably going to get really annoyed in the next five minutes. <laughs> but there's always hope. There is always hope. Yep, it's aggro rogue. <laughs> oh, wow. Why, why do you guys bother? Like, seriously. It's so bad. <laughs> What is this guy running? <laughs> oh my god. This is so bad. We'll see how we go against this bullshit cancer deck. Fan of knives. Are we gonna trade into this? No. <laughs> you don't need to trade. You don't need to trade. We're just gonna hit this guy, probably. I wonder whether we just, like, go face. I have more power on the board, so we can play his game. What? Does this guy not have, like, anything in his hand worth playing? Why does he cycle... Why does he cycle Fan of Knives? I mean, surely... Well, it's not aggro, obviously. It could be like some... Oil... With, uh, Loot Hoarder. But then why does he play... That on turn one? Hmm... Okay. Okay, so he's actually gonna remove this. Alright. So he's burnt a sap already, so that's a good sign. I mean, I've got Taunt forever in this deck. Well, in this hand anyway, so... If he's, if he's sapping um, Twilight Guardians, then surely he doesn't have much to play. Okay, so that's dead. What? He doesn't want to hit it. There's the Buccaneer. Um... I think we have to slam that way. It's not like we need cards, right? The only problem is Chillmore doesn't actually have a dragon in hand to get value. But still, a 6-6 taunt is gonna help, I think. Wow. Is this like Mill Rogue? With Buccaneers? And then why is he running a Loot Hoarder? <laughs> I don't know if this guy really knows. Maybe it is an aggro rogue and he just got a really bad hand or something. Like, it seems to be a lot of draw. Okay. Um, I have a dragon in hand now. So, I mean, he can sap this if he wants. 
but I'll just put it out again next turn. So one of the cold bloods is gone. Um, you know, that's a lot of his burst potential gone, but I am only on 17, so that's pretty bad, really. I wonder. I mean, normally I would say that a deck like this would actually probably be favoured against this deck. It's usually only against, like, real crazy face decks that you can sort of outpace them with armor. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. That's just fine with me. Buccaneer again. Uh, yeah, we bash that. Drake and bash that. Just the car would be good about now, but I mean, he's going through two uh, cold bloods. I, I don't see him killing me from this point. Okay, so he's going face with that. Oh no, he's going face with the eviscerate too. Well played. Sorry, buddy. Whatever that deck was. Every single one. And here we go. Here's another one. <laughs> Alright, Justicar is going to be good. It's a bit too early, though. Uh, Chillmore is going to be good, but it's a bit too early. I need things like bashes, shield blocks. Uh, revenge. Mm, could be good later on. Not really now. Alex Straza's champion would be good. Slam would be good. Anything would be good. Except what's in my hand right now. <laughs> uh, that's Actually, that's not too bad, but it's a little slow. I think if it's uh, a face... Oh yeah, it's obviously a face hunter. That's a good pickup. I think uh, I love Blackwing Technician in Warrior just because you can develop and basically swing with a weapon in one turn. Um, the new three mana, uh, what is it? Three, four taunt is going to be amazing, I think. I wonder what he does here. How can I get punished by not swinging? Leoc is definitely like, it's sort of weird because it's, it's sort of what you want to see. You'd rather see that than a half a bit. It's sort of hard to take out at the same time. You'd much prefer to have a death spite, you know, equipped to take it out. Even a slam would be fine. What? All right, he just goes face here for sure. Nope, we trade. Nope, he goes face. Okay, just the car is really good here. Um, the problem is, is to kill... Actually, I can save this, can't I? I can hit and then revenge. And then armor up as well. I have Blackwing next turn. That's going to be pretty good. Then just the car the turn after. And then hopefully I can just... Um, out armor him. It really depends on the next few turns, though. He has to play something with less than three health this turn. Uh, sort of also depends on what comes out of Shredder. And by the looks of it, if he's running Shredders, that's most likely a mid-range. All right, so that... Probably not that good. It's good for the moment, but... 
he combos it with a spell, that could be bad. Even like a, an Unleash the Hounds would clear that. It's a bit clunky for him though. What does he do here? How does he clear that? Quick shot doesn't really do it. Kill command doesn't really do it. He could play a beast and then kill command, but then that really sort of screws up his potential. He's just going to go face, yeah, for sure. The good news is that that is going to be an easy kill next turn. Um, that's a lot of damage coming in. Problem is, I am on 15, which is a bit of an issue. If I can get till turn 9, I'll be happy. Put this apple on your head. It's always better to have a board against a hunter, though. Does he trade here? Yeah, he does. Okay. So if I armor up, that's cancelling out the um, the shredder. I think I'd probably rather take out this guy. And then maybe Drake. I don't think I necessarily need to kill the shredder. Oh, that'll kill it. <laughs> Okay, whatever comes out, it can't kill me anyway, right? Cut purse. I can do a full clear here. That's pretty good. That bash was a sweet pickup. I think we're definitely going to get to turn 9 at this rate. Alright, so... I have to take that damage, which is unfortunate. Ooh. That's good. That is good. I think we smack... It all comes down to what he has in hand. He can't kill me through taunt, not with one card. If if he owls that, he's down to six mana. He can't kill me. He can... What? That's weird. Okay, there's the kill command. So I think I'm probably pretty good now, to be honest. I just want him to try and do as much damage as he possibly can. Okay, Alex Draws is champion and Drake. I'd say even Alex Draws, right? I don't need to necessarily play at this point. For the life binder. For the dragon queen. Yeah, I think we've got this. This will be like his final push, I'd say. He's got four here. Uh, is one kill command gone or two? I can't remember. Well played. We'll try one more, I think. Your soul shall be mine. Victory or death. Okay, so knowing the uh, recent meta, this is definitely Zoo. <laughs> one hundred percent. Or I could be wrong. Could be Handlock. In which case, that will be pretty good. Uh, assuming I can get enough armor to play it. Alright, let's see what he mulligans. Okay. Got rid of two. That's probably not good. If this is Handlock, then he definitely kept something. Probably going to see some sort of Drake coming out. Hmm. 
Wow, well, this dude is taking his time. Come on, man. Yeah. Okay, it's Sue. I, sometimes I just feel like just conceding straight away, but you know, you never know, you might get lucky. I do have a few more things in this deck that sort of help me out against Sue. But, you know, nine times out of ten I'm going to lose this one. So many possibilities. I mean, this is probably a pretty cool tool against Sue. Does he just power overwhelming this now? Nope, oh, flame it. Alright, so this is definitely like standard two, so. Oh, I, I don't have a dragon. Do I want a shield slam? You know what? Screw it. I'm only shield slamming a 2-1, uh, but I want to keep that armor. Alex draws his champion. It does allow me to execute that. And it does live. You never know. I might actually win this. Probably not though. It all comes down to like implosions and that sort of thing. Dark Bomb. Okay, so this guy is running Dark Bomb, so that's that's interesting. Okay, that's that's not good. That's actually really not good. Maybe I can just stall for a little bit. If I can get a boom down. I don't really want to play chill more. Um, I don't know if that's ever going to be good enough. Silence it. Dark Bomb. He's got two of them in the deck. That's really odd, actually. If I draw a dragon now, then I'm definitely going to play chill more. I don't have to, though. I can play Corruptor. I can play Corrupt. Oh, my God. Look at that. That's awesome. That's actually really good. That was a good top deck. All I need now is like Brawl. Wow, he obviously doesn't really have much. I mean, it's Sue. He's definitely got something. PO? Okay, cool. I think we're in business. If he's used both of his POs, he's lost... No, he's only used one PO, hasn't he? So... At least we get a good, um, boom turn. So one PO is down. Um, he still has a bit of burst. Obviously, Doom Guards. Does he play for nine, Malganus? Put this apple on your head. No. Oh, get wrecked. <laughs> oh, mate. Sorry. I 
I can just grom and execute here. I'm not too worried about it. I could chill more, but then I'm sort of losing my own guy. But if I grom and execute, then I'm leaving up. That could be a silence, and then I'm in trouble. I'd rather sort of keep Grom. I'm just sort of afraid of um, Doom Guards here. I think this will probably deal with this board. Yep, silence. At least it's still a 6-6 six, six, though. Okay, there's the Doom Guard. So that's getting executed, at least. That's that's a good sign. That's a little bit of his burst gone. And I can Grom into this guy now, so. Mm, Death Bite's pretty good. So I can Death Bite, Drake, and Execute. You cannot go wrong with that. I can't kill him next turn. I can definitely push some damage through. Whatever he puts out. Implosion. Oh, man. You know what? We might actually win this, to be honest. Yeah, please. That, that's good. I'm happy with that. Oh man, what could that be? Whatever it is though, I can grom it down, so I'll just have to do it. I could just go for lethal right now, but I think I'm probably more likely safe to just do this and then just whatever that is, just grom it down. Fuck, I forgot about that. That's bad. I didn't think about that. I might have just thrown the game by doing that. My shield for Argon. Um. Yeah, that's what I wanted to see. Dead to Doom God. I think that's the only thing I'm dead to. Void Call is fine. Bash? Visera. Sarah, I can handle. Does put me very, very low, though. That's the only thing I can play, though. Oh, but the problem is, is whatever comes out, it can't be a Doom Guard, right? This is really risky. Really, really risky. So many things that could kill me right now. Come on. Yes! Woo! Beat Zoo. Oh, wow. Man, when that Malganus came down, I thought I was so done. <laughs> wow. Good games, good games.